Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Anshika Mishra. Let's look at today's top medical news. Sharma study finds existing blood pressure drugs may prevent epilepsy. Stanford Medicine researchers and their colleagues have discovered that a class of drug already on the market to lower blood pressure appears to reduce adults' risk of developing epilepsy. The study published in JAMA Neurology suggested that the drug called angiotensin receptor blocker could prevent epilepsy in people at highest risk of the disease, including older adults who have had strokes. Epilepsy, often diagnosed in childhood, also affects over 1% of people over age 65 with seizures disrupting brain function and causing various symptoms. In older adults, stroke is a leading risk factor for epilepsy with 10% of stroke survivors experiencing seizures within 5 years. Vascular disease and chronic high blood pressure further increase the risk. While anti-seizure medication control epilepsy after diagnosis, no drug currently prevented in high-risk individuals. Recent studies, however, suggest that certain blood pressure medication might help prevent seizure by reducing inflammation, particularly in cases following stroke or traumatic brain injury, which can trigger epilepsy. Are you also aspiring to excel in medical journalism and delve into the intricacies of health and medical reporting? Explore our comprehensive course on medical and health journalism available at the Medical Dialogues Academy. Learn from industry experts who possess in-depth knowledge and experience in this field. For further details, scan the QR code provided or access the link in the description box below. In the study, researchers analyzed data from 2.2 million adults diagnosed with high blood pressure who were prescribed at least one blood pressure medication and did not have epilepsy. They found that individuals taking angiotensin receptor blocker had 20% to 30% lower risk of developing epilepsy compared to those taking other blood pressure drugs. This reduced risk remained even when patients with strokes were excluded from the analysis, indicating that the lower epilepsy rates were not solely due to the decreased risk of stroke. All blood pressure medications likely reduce the risk of epilepsy since high blood pressure contributes to the disorder. Controlling blood pressure through medication and lifestyle changes can lower epilepsy risk. However, new research suggests that angiotensin receptor blockers might be more effective than other antihypertensives in reducing the risk. In the study, 14% of participants took angiotensin receptor blockers. While the majority used other blood pressure medications such as beta blockers, calcium channel blockers and ACE inhibitors, said the authors. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for more updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.